<laughs> I mean, life still goes on. I mean, it's difficult. I'm not going to lie. For those, out here, for those of you out there who've dealt with these kind of things, I mean, I'm sure there's people who've been in long-term relationships a lot longer than me. And, I mean, I can only imagine being in a relationship or being married for years and years and years and just... Something clicked or something, something went clicked, wrong. Something went wrong and all those years are gone. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, I can only imagine, but then again, you got to keep going. Gotta That's keep all you can moving. do moving forward. Yeah, yes. that I think this is a good segue into... Um, just kind of pop this into my mind. Mm -hmm. I feel like the main reason behind this video would be I want to challenge the viewers um, or ev everyone will say everyone because not everyone is my viewer <laughs> sadly sadly but it's okay all, time will tell moving forward <laughs> yes I want to challenge people the human race as a whole <laughs> okay to not be afraid to start anew hmm. you know what I mean mm -hmm. we all make these New Year's resolutions, let's say, for for example. Everyone mm. makes one. No mm -hmm. one follows through with it. Of course. Or, you know, a lot of people make it through most of the year, but it, just, it yeah. falls apart of after course. a while. Um, and maybe that's their attempt at starting anew, but they can't forget the fact that, you know, like, oh, well, maybe I was happier back then being relaxed, lazy, or whatever, you know. That's true. But I, I feel like that's a major problem in the world is... Mm not being able to let the past go still learn from it still be cautious still be wary mm -hmm. um, because people you know things don't change all the time yeah but if we could all just consider starting over just hey clean slate let's be pals you know let's give each other a shot mm -hmm. cuz you know maybe maybe the reason why we weren't friends let's say or someone on the floor wasn't friends or anyone wasn't friends maybe that was just a fluke maybe it was a problem one of us was in the wrong both of us were in the wrong let's let's agree to disagree or let's agree mm -hmm. to agree from yeah. here on you know let's let's be new I, I feel like that could benefit a lot of people just realizing that starting over uh, it to me, I had a point in my life where that happened. Um, I told you about it last year, and it's not not for the video, sadly. Mm -hmm. um, but you feel you feel uh, alleviated. Is that the word I'm looking for? You feel relief, yeah. <laughs> severe relief. Mm -hmm. You feel light, lightweight. You know, like you could run a thousand miles and jump really high and all the weight is off of your shoulders you, like you're a kid again almost but you're still an adult so you're super cool mm -hmm. yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know that feeling it's a great feeling it really is and I don't know how I could stress that anymore that's saying that yeah. it, it is a nice feeling so uh, I, I challenge people to try and take steps towards doing that you know it, it's hard for people to just jump right in and say like alright you know what I forgive these people I want to give people a chance again or I want to give life a chance again. I want to mm -hmm. give video games a chance again. Golf, baseball, writing, mm -hmm. school, basketball, I don't know, yeah. drawing. <laughs> oh, yeah, for sure. I, I, I don't know. That's That would be my end goal, okay. I think. No, that's a noble goal. It's an admirable goal. I think everybody should take that to heart. Let me mm -hmm. go back to the whole New Year's resolutions, I guess. I feel like a lot of people don't follow through with those because I feel like they feel kind of obligated to do that. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like that, oh, Everyone's it's that doing time it. of the year. Everybody else is doing it, so here's my list. I don't want to do it, but here's my list anyway. Mm -hmm. So I guess that kind of harks on the notion that, I mean, do it for yourself. Do it for you. Do it for you. Just focus on yourself. I mean, don't let anybody else be an uh, inhibition to that. Mm -hmm. So don't do it for the wrong reasons. I mean, yeah, I don't know. Same thing. I could be with anything in life. I mean, like, don't dress a certain way just to look good for someone else in someone else's eyes. And do it because you feel comfortable in that respect and style. Yeah. I mean, you can give examples all day long. But, I mean, just do you. Simply put. <laughs> do it for yourself. And, I mean, once you do it for yourself, that's the only way you can actually inwardly reflect and actually look at yourself and see how you project that words. I mean, if you're just constantly looking through other people's eyes, you can't actually look deeper in. So Very true. Very but, true. 
You know, I read something um, the other day. Sorry to kind of jump in. No, go right ahead. Um, I read something the other day, and I feel like it strongly pertains to this. Um, and I've tried. I uh, All these things that we're saying, like, I'm trying to apply to my life and be better, you know, like, mm-hmm. help myself be happier and happier yeah. every day. Um, because I, as bad as it is to say, like, you know, I realized that at one point I did think I was at my peak in junior mm-hmm. year. I've said that many, many times in the past, but... I feel like I can always push towards a higher peak. There's always a higher mountain to climb. Mm-hmm. But I read something the other day, and I feel like that's one of the biggest things that people can do to help them move forward or help them get started, get kick-started. Um, and it's silly. It's silly, but to me, silly is good. Silly is happy. You know, is. Laughter is good. It is. So um, I read something that said... Wake up every morning and throw your fist in the air and say, you know, like shout yes or yeah or something excited. Get excited in the morning. Get so pumped up that you are going into the world today, that you are going to just crush whatever you're doing in the world today. Mm -hmm. Um, It is your day. Every day. That is your day. Okay. And I have started taking that mindset. I haven't done it every day mm-hmm. um, because there are some days where I'm just, you know, I'm tired as poop. Can't, can, you know, <laughs> like, I cannot deal with this right now. I can't even even can't. Exactly. Yes. 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 <laughs> but at the same time, the days that I have done it, those have been great days, mm-hmm. you know. Mm-hmm. Even if you have to, like, sit to yourself in the middle of the day, maybe you're at work, you're on your break, going to lunch break. Take the time to listen to your favorite song. Just get pumped. You know what? Just like get excited. Um, There's no reason to be to be bored or tired with with the things that you're doing in life. Because if you're Mm. if you're bored or tired with the things you're doing in life, do something different. Mm. Find what makes you happy. Find something that you can do during the day. That just get a schedule. I don't know, schedule something. I don't even like schedules. I like being random, spontaneous. So mm. that makes me happy. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> the anti schedule. <laughs> <laughs> but still, you know, I, I found that thing. I found things mm. that I can do during the day that's like, yes, like I'm, this day is, this day is good. This was exactly. a good check mark on this day. Mm. <laughs> um, yeah, for sure. I definitely kind of adopted that a little bit. I mean, as much as I love baseball, I found a little stagnation mm-hmm. this uh, a couple of months ago. I mean, got a little bored with it. It's mm-hmm. like okay, let's just divvy this up. I mean, I've always been a big fan of hockey, right? But um, since I got into college, I didn't really followed it as much. But I definitely become a lot bigger fan the past couple months. That was actually my goal early October. Like I'm gonna watch follow the season intently. Mm-hmm. Hockey's gonna be my baseball for this uh, fall and uh, spring semester. So that's what I'm gonna do, and it's been a rejuvenation. Cool. I mean, I kind of felt a little stagnation with baseball a little bit. I mean, this has been my passion for so many years. Now that it's not still my passion, mm-hmm. but I kind of need some little jump start, kind of like you're saying. Something just, fresh. Something fresh, something just to new. make you happy. I mean, baseball's still on there. I mean, the season's over, so I mean, I can focus on something else now. And you know, hockey's definitely stepped to the plate. and Full swing. Full swing. <laughs> it's no misses. It's been home runs ever since. But um, <laughs> Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Irony. Yes. But, um, oh, man. <laughs> but yeah, just doing that, I'm just divvying it up. I mean, sometimes I'm just sitting in my apartment board, and like I'll just jump in my truck and just go somewhere and just do whatever. I have done that you on know? some <laughs> days. Not not mm-hmm. here so much, but back mm-hmm. home, there have been days where I've just mm-hmm. been I've been stagnant. I exactly. have just been sitting there at home. I'm just like, you know what? I'm going to go for a drive. I'm going to go yeah. see something. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Go do something. Yeah, exactly. Blare some music. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Wake some people up with my music going down the <laughs> road now. No, don't do that. <laughs> I mean, pick and choose. Yeah, but, I mean, everyone yeah. has their own. Yeah. <laughs> of course, of course. Um, so, I don't know. I, I feel like, uh, well... No, I do have another couple things to say, I guess. No, <laughs> this is great. I'm, going, I'm enjoying going. this thoroughly. I hope exactly. you guys are enjoying this just as much as I am. I have noticed I am an RA this year, for those of you who don't know, who may be tuning in for the first time. Josh was my RA last year. He is currently a GHD. Sadly, not my GHD, but, you know, what? you can take what you can get. <laughs> it's okay. 
It's okay. It's, yeah, we get in trouble. But he was doing a great job, Beaver, so just to let you know. Well, upon that, you brought some to my attention yesterday um, that maybe I had been focusing on too many negative things. I've, I have been very stressed in this past week. Um, but focus on, you know, just like the YouTube videos that I used to make. Focus on if, if one person watches that video, to me, that video, mm. it made a difference. It is incredible. So mm-hmm. I need, I, I've really today, I started focusing again on, you know, you know, maybe I made that resident happy today, that, that resident happy today, mm-hmm. and that made their day that much better, and that made my day so much better. Yeah. Not to mention, you know, uh, go Gators today. Go Gators. Of course. <laughs> yeah, they had, uh, they put in, they put in the, the, second third fourth string guys and they yeah. got they got to do really cool things they and did. small things like that mm-hmm. you know small good random acts of kindness exactly exactly it's it's funny how much those things will actually make you happy <laughs> oh yeah for sure i mean just like the whole concept behind it takes a lot more muscles to frown no mm-hmm. more muscles to smile than it does to frown so just like a lot of things in life, it's so much easier to focus on the negatives than it is the positive. Go that extra distance, though. So, just like if negative things happen on the floor, per se, I mean, those things are going to take precedence over little things that you do that are positive speaking. Mm-hmm. So, it, it's it's a shame that a lot of negative things can trump positives, and that's in any relationship or anything you have mm-hmm. in life. But um, it's just actually picking and, not picking and choosing, but actually picking out the gems in the mind. And learning something from each of those Oh, mistakes yeah. you know like i don't take things personally now after <laughs> after our our little talk yesterday i the negative things on the floor i used to take very personally it's my first year as an ra i didn't know what to expect i thought you know my floor is gonna be perfect and <laughs> my guys are gonna like me i like my guys they're great then then they do something wrong and then it's just like mm, 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 <laughs> bond broken exactly no, and no, just I, look at the fact like if you feel like, like, oh, am I doing enough to actually garner that respect to my residents? Like, am I doing enough to actually make an impact? I mean, just by the fact that some people are being impacted, mm-hmm. the fact that some people are being respectful to you, that's that's showing you've done your job. Yeah, that's I mean, that means you've, definitely you've, right. you've shown them respect, you give them the right role model. Mm-hmm. I mean, you've done everything you have to do. I mean, some people just, regardless of what you do, regardless of what you have to say, regardless of what you put out there, I mean, that's their choice to pick it up. As long as you put it out there, I mean, that's all you can do. And you know what? You putting it out there, viewers, you putting it out there, that's what's going to matter to you. And then mm-hmm. make that matter to you if it doesn't. Exactly. Realize that you putting it out there was so much better than what so many other people have done. Mm-hmm. And then it'll make it that much better when that resident or that person does notice what you've done. Oh, yeah, for sure. So I think that's a good stopping point for this episode. We have <laughs> we have gone quite long. I do enjoy it. This will be a two, two, uh, I guess section episode. But yes. hey, what can you do? <laughs> that was a good one. It was a good one. It was. Join us next time for whatever we decide to talk about. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, <laughs> yeah, you gotta get over that whooping cough, man. Gotta get over that whooping cough. Don't forget to like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. Shadow Rockets out.